The Chandler Cultural Foundation determined it was time to create a donor wall that was reflective of the gathering space the center had become. Working with the city's visual arts coordinator, a call for artists and their design ideas for the new wall went out into the community. We looked up a lot of like donor walls in some of the libraries and some of the local places um, that we have access to and they all look like they're meant to be seen from a distance and they felt unapproachable and not necessarily inviting. And to me, any art that I am interested in, I feel it should be accessible. And at the time we were like, what if there was a wall that was not a wall, but it was more like an installation, but it's still a wall. And, and you could play around with it. It had multiple sides and, and it would tell you a story uh, depending on which side you approach it from. There were just ideas that we wrote down in a proposal of not fully knowing how to do them. And once we wrote them down, we were like, well, I think we need to find somebody who can help make this real. From there, we were able to say, okay, well, 12 columns is the right number of columns for this project. They need to be about a foot on each face and to keep people from getting pinched when they're spinning, we need a little bit of extra space. I think another part of the inspiration is just seeing those kind of graphic images that can change as you move by them and understanding how that works on a very small level and seeing if we can make it happen on a larger, more interactive level. The concept was to honor the donors, but also have something interactive and really exciting for people actually visiting the space to touch and it can, it's, you know, child-proof and that you don't have to be too precious with, but that is still definitely a piece of art. We also wanted to play with how perspective and point of view plays into each individual's understanding of art. And so we were able to play with, with the different surfaces and the design. For the installation, we wanted to do three sides because it's like a nod to the past, present, and future of this space. Um, and each of those three sides also tell a story of like what happens in this space. And because the arts open minds and the arts brings people together and the arts also shows us new worlds, those three sides combine to tell a story of the space and also the impact art has on us as individuals and as a community. I hope that when people see the wall, that they want to know more. That they, they come up and they read the names, or they come up and they rotate the different parts. They try and mix and match a little bit. We wanted something that would inspire people to both look at it and to make contributions to arts and culture here in Chandler. The donor wall features 30 years of cumulative giving and members of the Jerry Brooks Legacy Society for planned gifts they have left to the CCA to preserve the arts for generations to come.